So Kelly, thank you for joining us. We're so excited to have you uh, come in for a call as we celebrate yet another of our fun pop-up grants. uh, And so this grant goes to Saving Teens in Crisis Collaborative. So congratulations and thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you so much for having me and thank you for awarding and selecting Saving Teens to be the recipient of the pop-up grant. We're so excited. I think Thayer should give a little bit of background about how and why you got selected, because I think it is um, it is very exciting to know that young people are thinking about philanthropy and the nonprofits that are out there doing great things. Yes. So we were uh, Cynthia Clegg and I were honored to be asked by Len Miller to come and speak to one of his classes at Eastern Connecticut State University. And so part of that was that we encouraged the students to submit the name of their favorite nonprofit. Um, because we love our pop-up grant initiative. It's it's definitely very fun and gets everyone involved. And for those that don't know what it is, we put the name of the nominations in a basket, we give it a big shake, and we pull out one to receive a small pop-up grant. And uh, Shelly Feder, I hope I'm saying her last name correctly, Shelly Federhoff nominated Saving Teens in Crisis Collaborative, which is very exciting for us because you're new to us as well. So we all get to learn a little bit about the work that you do. And and thank you to Len Miller and his class at Eastern Connecticut State University for welcoming us in for a panel discussion and for joining in the pop-up grant initiative. So Kelly, tell us all about your organization. Sure. So Saving Teens was founded in 2004 by a parent who unfortunately was struggling with two teenagers himself, his sons, who needed um, access to treatment and really needed uh, more care than what was provided outpatient through school system, things like that. So he, along his journey, found many families that could not afford the treatment that really their teen needed to be successful. So uh, John Rubin formed Saving Teens, and since 2004, we've been providing free services to families. We connect them with uh, educational consultants. We, um, th- For those who qualify, they are awarded scholarships and provided financial assistance so they can access the treatment that they need uh, for their teen. And we also provide them other resources, um, whether it's professional links through our website, um, articles that are really helpful, um, connections with other parents so they know they're not alone. Um, Saving Teens just really, we really try to help families who need the financial assistance to access treatment for their team, but also just provide them with knowing that they're not alone and that there's they're not the only families that are are enduring the struggles of mental health and uh, the struggles of raising a, a teenager currently. So um, we we help families throughout the United States, and we're currently offering up to thirty thousand dollars per family um, that qualify for a scholarship. So wow. it's an honor. Yeah, it's an honor that we're we're the recipient of this award. It's an honor that uh, Shelly is. Uh, you know, not afraid to bring up mental health and really support our mission because it's it's really a huge need, especially post COVID. Um, there's a lot of teenagers that are struggling, so uh, we we can't do it without the support of of the people and the community. And so we're really grateful to and we and honored that we were selected. So, how did you get involved, Kelly? I got involved. um, I worked nonprofit for for quite a few years. And um, at the time, I'm a mother of three boys. At the time when I saw this job, my 16 year old, now he is 22, was struggling. And and I just really, really related to the mission of the organization and really just am passionate about it. Um, You know, as a parent, I see how difficult it is for kids nowadays with social media, with internet, with the demands and the pressures that they face in school. And it's um, really, really hard when you have a a child, teen that's struggling with mental health. So um, it's it's definitely a personal 
Um, and and it's just a passion that I have um, because I, I really see that there's such a huge difference. The kids that end up getting the treatment that they really need, um, the tools that they receive, it, it changes their lives. And they really, really have a chance at being successful and really giving back and being the best version of themselves. So I truly enjoy giving that opportunity to families. And I also really like communicating with families, with parents and letting them know that they're not alone and it's nothing that they did. It's mental health is, is just something like anything else that uh, a teen, a, a child can struggle with. And, you know, providing that support is huge. And I want to say thank you to Shelly because you're located, we should probably tell everyone your low, your, your office location is Wallingford. Connecticut. And Correct. so um, your organization was new to us as well. And so this is one of the opportunities that we really appreciate is learning about nonprofits that are doing extraordinary work like yours um, that we may not have heard about. So what is the one thing that anyone seeing this could do to help you connect in, in in a broader sense with maybe people who need help or partner nonprofits that can help to get your word out? It's really spread the awareness. You know, our mission is to provide free services, to provide access for teens to get the treatment that they need. Um, so as anybody that can help us with the outreach, more people that know about saving teens, the more teens that we can, we can help. So whether it's uh, on a volunteer basis, whether it's just guiding people to our website, you know, people, I always tell them, give them my phone number, let them call me. Uh, you know, I, I know what parents are going through. It, it can be such a, a, a hard moment and, you know, they really don't know what to do. So I just think as long as more people know about us and, and the word is spread, it, it's just the beginning and everything else comes along. So let's help you spread Sorry. the word. So please give us your phone number and the yes, uh, how, to, how to reach you. Oh, if you or anybody that would like to get in touch with Saving Teens, um, it could be a family, it could be a person that would like to volunteer, they can contact Kelly Brown. My phone number is 860-977-7198. And our website is savingteens.org. Wonderful. Thank you so much. We will definitely help to share that. You're doing remarkable work and we're so appreciative of it. Thank you. And I, I would like to thank you for what your work too, because I'm sure I'm not the only organization that you've heard of by reaching out and doing your community work and your pop-up grants. So I, I think what you're doing is tremendous as well. And you're helping a lot of organizations like myself. So thank you. Well, thank you for that, but congratulations to you and a round of applause for you. Thank you. Thank Yay. You. you definitely will make an impact. And I know that the families and the teens that we, the families we help truly are so grateful. And one of the best parts of my job is to staying in contact with some of the families that we've helped and talking to them afterwards, hearing how, how much progress has been made since, you know, when they were actually like going through you know, the rough times. And it's, it's always a, a tough journey, but there's a lot of great stories, you know, after kids get help. So it's encouraging. Well, the future looks bright for our young people because of you. Thank you, Kelly. Oh, thank you. I appreciate it. Well, thank you. And Good luck in 2023, and we appreciate all you do, and we look forward to connecting again and and uh, hearing more progress. Thank you to uh, Shelley Federoff for nominating uh, um, Saving Teens. It's been great to get to know you and hear all about your work. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Have a nice day. And you too. You too.